This is a recast of the 4900 word piece. But topic topic modeling made easy from GPT-5. Let's listen in. In a world where data rules, the ability to extract valuable information from large volumes of text plays a crucial role. Topic modeling is one of the key techniques that enables the identification of hidden themes in texts and their systematic analysis. This method is not only significant in academic research, but also finds wide use in numerous practical applications. Traditionally, models like the latent Dirichlet allocation, LDA, have been used to identify themes in texts. But with the advent of deep neural networks and natural language processing, NLP, new, more powerful methods have developed. One of these methods is Bertopic, a technique based on the BERT model that utilizes the advantages of transformer models as well as advanced clustering methods to precisely extract themes from texts. The relevance of Bertopic in today's text analysis is undeniable. In market research, for example, companies can gain deeper insights into their product's reception by analyzing customer reviews or social media posts. In social media analysis, Pertopic allows for real-time identification of trends and sentiments, which can be crucial for crisis management or brand strategy. The target of this article is to give the reader an in-depth understanding of how Bertopic works, covering both theoretical foundations as well as practical areas of application. This includes a comprehensive presentation of the methodology, including mathematical foundations, implementation, and fine-tuning. The article addresses both beginners in the field of topic modeling and experienced data scientists who wish to expand their knowledge. Besides a detailed introduction into the theoretical basics, the article contains practical application examples that illustrate the use of topic in the real world. It also provides an outlook on future developments and possible extensions of topic. The fundamental theory behind topic modeling explains that it is a technique used in text analysis to identify hidden topics within large amounts of unstructured texts. This method is especially useful to recognize structural patterns in text data and allows researchers and analysts to search through complex document collections and extract content focuses. Traditional methods of topic modeling, like LDA, have served as standard procedures over many years. LDA is a generative statistical model that attempts to explain a set of documents as a mixture of different topics, with each topic again being represented as a mixture of words. The limitations of traditional methods like LDA lie in their ability to capture deeper semantic relationships and contextual dependencies. That's where new methods like Bertopic come into play, which are based on advanced NLP techniques. Unlike LDA, which is based on a probabilistic assumption and purely statistical distribution of words, Bertopic uses contextual embeddings capable of better mapping semantic relationships between words. This leads to more precise and coherent topics that can be extracted from text data. The BERT model plays a central role in Bertopic as it's used to generate vector representations of texts. These representations, also called embeddings, are dense, high-dimensional vectors capturing semantic content in numerical form. Thanks to BERT, these embeddings can consider not only single word meanings, but also the context in which these words are used. The embeddings generated by BERT form the basis for the clustering process in Bertopic. The aim of clustering is to group texts with similar themes. Bertopic uses advanced clustering methods like Havscan to identify groups of texts that lie in a similar semantic space. This can create more precise and thematically coherent clusters than traditional methods. The mathematical foundations of Bertopic encompass several advanced concepts of machine learning and statistical analysis. A central element here is vector transformation through BERT, which transforms the text into a dense, high-dimensional vector form. These vectors form the basis for the subsequent clustering methods. To handle the vector representations and enable clustering, Protopic uses UMAP, Uniform Manifold Approximation and Projection. UMAP is a nonlinear technique for dimensionality reduction that is particularly good at preserving the underlying structure of high-dimensional data. After the embeddings have been reduced by UMAP HEBSCAN, hierarchical density-based spatial clustering of applications with noise is used to identify the actual topic clusters. HEBSCAN is a density-based clustering method that is robust against noise in the data and does not require a fixed number of clusters. Implementing Bertopic requires installing the necessary libraries and setting up the Python environment. 
Once that's done, you can create a simple protopic model to gain a better understanding of how it works. In terms of practical use, Bertopic has proven extremely useful in a variety of application areas. For example, in analyzing Twitter data, social media is an inexhaustible source of unstructured text data that enterprises and researchers can use to analyze opinions, trends, and sentiments. Another area of application is analyzing customer feedback on e-commerce websites. Bertopic can be used to extract the most common themes that concern customers from thousands of product reviews. This can give a company valuable insights into the pros and cons of their products and identify areas where improvements are needed. In scientific research, Bertopic can be used to analyze large amounts of literature to identify current research focuses. By clustering similar articles, researchers can identify which topics are particularly relevant in their discipline and where there may be gaps in research. The article does a thorough comparison of Bertopic with traditional methods like LDA and newer approaches like top 2 vec The limitations of traditional methods like LDA lie in their ability to capture deeper semantic relationships and contextual dependencies as compared to modern methods like Bertopic. Bertopic combines the advantages of embeddings with advanced clustering methods like KevScan, which leads to more robust and flexible topic identification. Bertopic also handles noise and data much better and allows finer control over model parameters. The practical implications of Bertopic are far-reaching. With its ability to recognize deeper semantic relationships and capture contextual nuances in texts, Bertopic offers significant advantages over traditional topic modeling methods. This makes it a powerful tool for industries that rely on analyzing large amounts of unstructured data. For businesses, this means gaining valuable insights into customer opinions, market trends, and public perception of their brands. Bertopic can be used in real-time analyses of social media data or processing customer feedback to quickly react to changes in the consumer landscape. For the scientific community, Bertopic provides an efficient method for analyzing extensive literature corpora, thereby identifying current research trends and closing research gaps. Particularly in interdisciplinary areas, Bertopic can contribute to discovering thematic overlaps and new fields of research. The continuous adaptation to these and other emerging trends will further increase Bertopic's relevance in data analysis and continue to provide valuable insights into the structure and content of large text data. To sum up, Bertopic not only offers a current solution for topic modeling, but also has the potential to significantly change the way we analyze and interpret large amounts of texts. It's a versatile, powerful tool that proves extremely useful in a variety of application areas and will continue to gain importance in the future. That's it for today. 